Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, guys? I'm back again with another video. Guys, this time I'm going to show you another tip and trick that I do for my new ride here. Um, actually, what I do is um, I clay my wheel covers. I'll show you guys. Now, you can use like an APC or like this here. Spray right on the wheel covers. After you clean them the best you can. Now, I clean them first. But now I'm claying them with just water and APC like this here. I actually clay my wheel covers so they make it easy to clean. So, cause you know when contaminants are on your wheel covers, it makes the other stuff stick right to them. See, I just take my clay sponge like this and I clay my wheel covers like this right here. I clay it guys. And what this does, this helps keep the dirt from sticking right down to them brake dust and all that stuff just clam and it pulls all the contaminants and stuff off your rims or wheel covers as well everything i'm using the nano skin clay which is my favorite the reason why i like this the best out of all clay sponges is because i can squeeze it and it stay lubed up see here it's got the sponge in the back you can squeeze it and it stay lubed so i'm showing you guys some more tips and tricks just clay your wheel covers man Clam the best you can, get up in there, clam out. Because when you clay it, see, it's going to make it easy to clean. There won't be no contaminants for dirt and grime and brake dust and all that stuff to stick to. See here? And see how good that look? Just by clearing the wheel cover. So first, you clean them up the best you can. Get all that excess dirt and all that stuff off. Use something like an APC I'm using here is an APC. Spray it up there. Let it sit a minute or two. Got to clean them first. Now I'm just using this to help pick up extra contaminants. I take my clay. I take my clay. Clay sponge come right behind us like this. Clam up. This help pull off all that junk. Cause you know your wheel covers pick up a lot of grime and junk, man. I mean, you pick up more junk here than anything on the car, basically. See, so you want these clayed up, lubed up. Then you can protect it with like a spray some spray wax on them, some detail spray or something like that. Help protect them from getting so grimed and dirty. Make them slick, see. That makes them slick. Keep stuff from sticking to them. Just go on up in there and clam out. Sure. So all you gotta do is throw out some tricks and tips like this. And it's a done deal. That's what I do. I clay mines, guys. And this is like a hundred percent difference between not clean and clean when it comes to cleaning them. Now you can tell a clay wheel cover and a rim versus one that's not clay because all the contaminants that's there. All the other dirts and grimes and everything else sticks right in it, which make them harder to clean. See, you want to make them as easy to clean as possible. That's what you want to do. Make them easy to clean as possible. So, you don't want to stick all that dirt, grime, and all that stuff. You want all that stuff to come right off. You can almost spray it off. Then you can put some self-cleaning stuff up there, something like some Gion wet coat or something like that. Um, you can spray some um, some up, you know. Gion wet coat is another good one that you can spray on your rims. Make them self-cleaning. Because when that brake dust really sticks, guys, the wind is up a little. It's been kind of stormy around here. Um, windy all day long. I don't know what's going on, but it's just been that way. And, uh, yeah, you can just um, do this, and uh, it'll really help clean them. See, all that grime, and, you know, just think that your wheel covers go through a lot. A lot of dirt and grime gets on them. Brake dust, whatever, whatever, it settles right down on the wheel. So this is another good trick that you can use. You can clay it, you can use a clay bar, clay sponge. I recommend a clay sponge because when you drop it, now, if you accidentally just drop it on the ground or whatever, you can just pick it right up and rinse it off. You ain't got to worry about throwing it away or none of that stuff. So that's a, another good thing with that. And um, yeah, I just, I just 
just try to um, bring you guys some good tricks and tips out here, man, on stuff that, you know, you can use and um, just get the job done, how your ride looking good in no time. That's all you got to do, man. That's all you got to do. Tips and tricks to get your ride looking good. And this is just going to make everything to take off all the contamination and all that stuff off your wheel covers and your rims as well. And it'll make them just so easy to clean. That's all you want, man. Make them easy to clean. Because, you know, some of the rims that brake does really get stuck on the rims. I mean, get stuck on them hard, too. And it makes them difficult to clean. And that's what you don't want. Okay? So, there you have it, man. Story ain't got some tricks and tips out there. And I'm using the a nano skin out of scrub sponge here uh, which is my favorite this is my favorite clay sponge i like it because it stay lube we got the sponge in the back and uh, it works great man i like the nano skins it's one of the best clay sponges on the market in my opinion so yeah get the wheel covers and the rims right guys all right throwing y'all some tips if you're new to my channel don't forget to comment rate and subscribe share my videos with your family and friends and um yeah guys till next time you guys take care and i'll hit y'all on the next video i'm out of here peace